Welcome. If you want to share files or connect with other devices using WhatsApp's latest features, you'll need to allow access to nearby devices. This permission is essential for features like People Nearby, which lets you transfer documents or images securely without revealing your phone number. Here's how you can enable nearby devices access for WhatsApp on your Android phone, step by step. First, unlock your phone and open your device's settings. This is where you can control all your app permissions and manage how apps interact with your phone. Next, scroll down and tap on apps, or it might be called app management depending on your phone model. This section lists every application installed on your device. Now find WhatsApp in the list. You can scroll through the apps or use the search bar at the top to quickly locate WhatsApp. Once you see it, tap on WhatsApp to open its settings. Inside the WhatsApp app settings, look for the permissions option and tap on it. Here, you'll see all the different permissions WhatsApp can request, like access to your camera, microphone, contacts, and more. Find the option labeled Nearby Devices. Tap on it, and you'll see choices for allowing or denying access. Select Allow to grant WhatsApp permission to connect with nearby devices. This step is crucial for enabling features like sharing files with people nearby or connecting to wearables and other smart devices. Once you've allowed nearby devices access, WhatsApp will be able to discover and communicate with devices around you, making file transfers and device pairing seamless and secure. Remember, you can always return to these settings if you want to adjust or revoke this permission later. That's it. You've now enabled nearby devices access for WhatsApp. With this permission, you're ready to take advantage of WhatsApp's latest sharing and connectivity features, all while keeping your privacy and security in mind. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to check out more tips to get the most out of your apps.